people of YouTube, I am Sean Benedict, and you might not know me for doing these kind of videos on my, uh, my, me and my friend's account, but I decided to try some of these. You see I have three groups of very different and more unique styles of Legos. I do warn you that there will be some parts where you need to make them yourself where you need to cut off a few things or bend a thing here or there but like I said it's really worth it and the end result is really good all right the first thing we're going to make today is a bazooka what you're going to need to do is take this group of Legos right here get one of these megaphone pieces and one of these tube pieces and connect them put that down now, this is going to be harder to find, but try and find like a drill piece like this and a black piece like this and connect these two. Now, connect the two pieces together and a bazooka right there. Alright. Now, for a flamethrower, you're going to need a small gun, uh, laser gun like this, a piece like this. A, one of these connector pieces and then handle pieces. Note that I do bend the handle piece with some needle nose pliers. Needle nose pliers, so if you can't get the exact same result, it still looks cool either way. And then a flame piece. So, what you're going to do is connect the flame piece in to the hole of one of these connector pieces, like so. Then take the gun piece and connect it into the other end. Now, for the last step, take one of these connector pieces, put it right on the end like that. So, there you go, flamethrower. Alright, now for the piece de resistance, the machine gun. Alright, so what you're going to do for this is take a square piece like this and put it on one of these like so. Then, take a piece like this and put it right on top like that. Take a vent piece like this and plop it right on top. Looking like this. Alright. Now, this starts to get a bit harder. Put the piece in Put, all right, so this piece, it's one of those laser cannon pieces that you always see and stuff. Um, but I had to cut it in half due to one of my other creations. Right here. Connect this end right here like so. Now, attach one of these nozzle pieces right in the back. Add this to the bottom. And just for a little added flair, I took one of the handle pieces and cut the nose off and put it right here to look like a belt going in. And there you go, machine gun. Um, so, to accumulate this last this at uh, the end of this episode, I will show you all of this. Take a good long look. And actually, I'll now show you my second piece the resistance. My 88 millimeter flak gun emplacement. This is where this one goes. Right up here, like so. So, I'll give you a few looks. There is a knob in the back to turn the flat gun. I'll give you a quick turn look back in the back. There is crates using this piece right here, or this piece. I supply it with flak rounds, shells, and like I said, I did, I did make custom pieces 
like the tips of these lasers, that is where the tip of the machine gun came from. But sits down and now a pose with my flak master in it. One second. There we go. Flak master in. Fire! If you really want it, I could post on a video of how to build this, but only if I get 30 requests. So comment, review, if you need if you have any other suggestions, tell me. But to culminate, bazooka, flamethrower, machine gun. It's simple. Good night and good luck.